ITUG 992.5 is an international telecommunication union standard for asymmetric digital subscriber line broadband Internet access. The standard has a maximum theoretical download speed of 24 Mbit s. Utilizing G992.5 Annex M upload speeds of 3.3 Mbit s can be achieved. Technical information, ADSL 2 Plus extends the capability of basic ADSL by doubling the number of downstream channels. The data rates can be as high as 24 Mbit s downstream and up to 1.4 Mbit s upstream depending on the distance from the DSL AM to the customer's premises. ADSL 2 Plus is capable of doubling the frequency band of typical ADSL connections from 1.1 MHz to 2.2 MHz. This doubles the downstream data rates of the previous ADSL2 standard, and like the previous standards will degrade from its peak bit rate after a certain distance. Also ADSL2 Plus allows port bonding. This is where multiple ports are physically provisioned to the end user and the total bandwidth is equal to the sum of all provisioned ports. So if two lines capable of 24 Mbit S were bonded the end result would be a connection capable of 48 Mbit S download and twice the original upload speed. Not all DSL AM vendors have implemented this functionality. ADSL 2 Plus port bonding is also known as G998X or G-Bond. Deployment equals Europe equals Austria. In Austria, ADSL 2 Plus is offered by all copper line service providers, with major ones being Telecom Austria, TL2 Austria, UPC and Silver Server. The majority of DSL AMs are capable of supporting ADSL 2 Plus technology while older equipment is limited to ADSL. Belgium, ADSL 2 Plus has a coverage of 85% nationwide. Initially, ADSL 2 Plus was used to support IPTV. Speeds are limited at 12 Mbit s. Belgacom's reference offer is called BROBA2. Smaller ISPs use the BROBA2 network, as well as providers who have their own ADSL 2 Plus equipment. There are a few other providers who have their own equipment installed in some cities, availability is therefore narrow. Destiny NV offers an ADSL 2 Plus subscription for professional use, with speeds of up to 24 Mbit s downstream and 1 Mbit s upstream. Dommel offers three ADSL 2 Plus subscriptions, with speeds of up to 24 Mbit s downstream and 3 Mbit s upstream. EDPNET offers two ADSL 2 Plus subscriptions at 24 Mbit s downstream and 1 Mbit s upstream with 100 GB data volume included. They are called ADSL Home and ADSL Office. Scarlet The package is called Scarlet ADSL 20 No Limit. The download speed is capped at 20 Mbit S and upload is as high as 1 Mbit S. The download volume is based on FUP. There are several smaller ISPs that use the services of Scarlet. Scarlet's reference offer is called BAUO. Belgacom bought Scarlet. One of the conditions was to sell the BAUO network to a third party. Teal 2 slash KPN Belgium offers ADSL 2 Plus subscriptions, the maximum speed is limited at 12 Mbit s downstream and 1 Mbit s upstream. There is no download limit. Bosnia and Herzegovina, ADSL 2 Plus is offered by the following operators, BH Telecom Nationwide and Logosoft in Sarajevo, Zenica and Tizla. In the Serb Republic entity, M. Tell DSL AM network devices show ADSL 2 Plus, however, M. Tell still continues to provide speeds up to 10,240 640 according to their website. Bulgaria In Bulgaria, ADSL 2 Plus is offered by the national telecom operator Vivicom. Speeds up to 20 Mbit S downstream and 2 Mbit upstream. Available almost everywhere DSL is offered. Croatia In Croatia, ADSL 2 Plus is offered by all service providers, with major ones being H1 Telecom, TCOM, Optima Telecom, Amos Telecom, ISKON Internet and Metronet Telecomunikasijge. All DSL AMs are capable of supporting ADSL 2 Plus technology. The foremost reason for introduction of ADSL 2 Plus was introduction of IPTV service by TCOM, which required major bandwidth increase. 
Almost all service providers offer ADSL 2 Plus subscriptions at speeds up to 20 Mbit-s downstream and up to 768 KBITS upstream. All service providers provide a flat rate model with unlimited traffic. Amos Telecom, Vinit, H1 Telecom, Iscon, Optima Telecom, and Vatsky Telecom offer IPTV. Czech Republic, in the Czech Republic as of 2008, the ADSL ADSL 2 Plus coverage is above 90% of all fixed phone lines, however maximum attainable rates vary. In many locations, and even in major cities such as Prague or Bno, the maximum speed does not even reach Formbit S because of the telephone cabling quality. Pricing plans of the biggest ADSL provider, Telefocubed Nico 2 Czech Republic, range from a 23 per month for 8192-512 kbits to a 27 per month for 16384-768 kbits. There is also a wholesale offer for alternative ADSL providers, nevertheless the end-user price in such case does not differ significantly from that of O2. Less than 5% of all ADSL customers use the offers based on the wholesale offer. There are about half dozen alternative ISPs that offer data plans utilizing the so-called LLU. In this case the final price is about 25% lower than that of O2. However the LLU is typically available only in large cities. The list of LLU providers includes the following campaigns, GTS Navara, Alaska Copyright Radio Communiques a Euro 8192-512 KBITS for 699, CZK, 20480-1024 for 899, CZK, Volna one half slash Telecom Austria Czech Republic, Bought by Dial Telecom in December 2008 a Euro 8192-512 KBITS for 699, CZK, 16384-768 KBITS. For 929, CZK, you can check whether there are LLU offers available on your phone line. The site also estimates the maximum attainable speed on your line. Denmark. All major DSL providers in Denmark offers ADSL 2 Plus, including Tele Sonora, TDC, Telenor, Fulred, and Perspective Bread by NND. As of 2007, approximately 90% of the country is covered, although maximum bandwidth is available in and around the cities, that is not classified as villages or smaller. TDC provides triple play. Estonia ADSL 2 Plus together with a triple play solution is deployed on a large scale by Lion Enterprises Limited. Download speeds are, depending on package, up to 16 bit s and upload speeds are up to 1 bit s. A map detailing the availability of ADSL 2 Plus has been made available. ADSL 2 Plus is also offered by Elisa and SDAS. Speeds range from 5 bit s to 24 bit s. Finland ADSL 2 Plus and Triple Play solutions are offered by the major DSL providers in certain areas. Usually maximum download speed when using ADSL 2 Plus is 24 bit s and upload speed 1 bit s. Also Nebula, Swomicom, DNA, KPO, JNT, Vinet and many other ISPs provide ADSL 2 Plus connections. France ADSL 2 Plus and Triple Play solutions are offered by the major DSL providers except in some rural areas. Usually maximum download speed when using ADSL 2 Plus is 24 bit s and upload speed 1 bit s. 30% of population is actually limited to 2 bit s due to the DSL AM's lower bandwidth. Germany, Deutsche Telekom as former monopolist controls the majority of all end-user telephone lines. It has rolled out ADSL 2 Plus technology and now deploys VDSL 2 outdoor DSL AMs in urban areas. Many of the providers listed below are reselling services provided by DTAG or at least rent the last mile from it. Some exceptions are regional providers who offer to connect houses in their areas for around €8,000. Georgia, ServiceNet provides ADSL 2 Plus services from late 2005. Local upload up to 1 bit s and download speed up to 24 bit s, 
Silknet has enabled ADSL2 Plus for some PSTN lines and for GEPON technology, Caucasus Online has enabled ADSL2 Plus for some PSTN lines, bases of acquired ISP Sanet, officially not in service since it is pushing GEPON technology, a colleague cell buyers using ADSL2 Plus for some of subscribers. Greece, as of December 2014, most DSL providers started offering ADSL2 Plus from their proprietary network. These are, CYTA Hell as a Euro Double Play Services a Euro up to 24 bit S downstream, 1 bit S upstream. Fourthnet, 1, a Euro offers double play services, 2, a Euro up to 24 bit S downstream, 1 bit S upstream. Hellas Online a Euro offers double play services a Euro up to 24 bit S downstream, 1 bit S upstream. OTE, 3, a Euro offers triple play a Euro up to 24 bit S downstream, 1 bit S upstream. Wind Hellas a Euro offers double play services a Euro up to 24 bit S downstream, 1 bit S upstream. Vodafone a Euro offers double play services a Euro up to 24 bit S downstream, 1 bit S upstream, via Hellas online network. Hungary, in Hungary, since mid-2006, multiple telecom companies have started offering ADSL2 Plus services. As of July 2007, TCOM, the biggest Hungarian ISP, is silently upgrading its customers' ADSL connections to ADSL2 Plus, although with no speed changes. Iceland Zarmin offers ADSL2 Plus nationwide. Vodafone Iceland offers ADSL2 Plus to all its customers. Ireland, Magnet Business offers ADSL2 Plus services with its rollout to many exchanges in urban areas over the incumbent's copper local loop. 10 bit S downstream and 1 bit S upstream is a typical offering for their business broadband. Major cities initially as Magnet rolls out its unbundled exchange project. Its ADSL2 Plus services are also available to residential customers, along with its fiber to the premises service which is available in certain residential developments. Smart Telecom offer ADSL2 Plus products to residential customers who were connected to any of their growing network of unbundled exchanges. The company have service in 37 Irish exchanges covering large areas of most of the major cities in Ireland. They have an entirely IP-based NGN built around multiple service access nodes MSANs and carrier-grade voice over IP, multimedia and other services are provided using Thompson SA Serpac soft switch technology. This equipment provides the end user with both high-speed broadband internet access and normal POTS service all over the same entirely IP-based infrastructure. BT Island On July 30, 2008 BT Island launched 24 bit S service on its LLU exchanges. Arcom In April 2009 Arcom, the Irish incumbent launched 24 bit S and 12 bit S Annex M services on 100 of its 1,200 exchanges with another 200 smaller exchanges to follow by year-end 2009. In January 2010 Arcom launched a 24-bit SADSL2 Plus residential service using an EXA profile on the same 100 exchanges. By year-end 2012 they finally reached 300 exchanges. Italy, most minor and major Italian operators, now operates up to 20-bit S. This offer is theoretical. To actually get the maximum rate, the customer needs to be attached to an ATM DSLAM, served by an STM1 converter, that isn't also serving more than two DSLAMs contemporaneously. This kind of network setup is now available almost anywhere, even in small towns. Since 2007, Telecom Italia is operating gigabit Ethernet DSLAMs, offering 7, 10 and 20 bit S rates. The, still partial, coverage of the GBE solution, is meant to spread to and cover most cities now served by ATM DSLAMs rated at 7 bit S. Malta, Geo, 4, as of July 2008, started to offer ADSL2 plus speeds between 8 bit S and 20 bit S download speeds in direct competition with local cable internet supplier on ball. A number of lines are still using ITUG 992.1 and XB but the company will upgrade the line on demand. Macedonia, 
ST Home and one other two ISPs which offer ADSL2 Plus in Macedonia, with download speeds up to 20 Mbit S and upload speeds up to 1 Mbit S. T Home and ON.net can deliver their services across the country. T Home offer IPTV services, with high definition television and established an optical network to the users in part of the capital city of Scorpia in 2010. Moldova, the biggest ADSL provider, Mold Telecom is deploying ADSL 2 Plus, G992.5 and XA, throughout all Moldova. Their current broadband offer tops up 20 Mbit S download 1 Mbit S upload for $20. The new ADSL 2 Plus infrastructure is available since December 2009. Intense Euro other providers broadband offer tops at 8 Mbit S download 512 KBITS upload for $35 since April 1, 2010. The other ADSL 2 Plus provider is Starnet, which deployed its infrastructure mainly in Chisinau and Balti. Montenegro, Kronogorsky Telecom is ISP which offer ADSL2 Plus in Montenegro, with download speeds up to 8.5 Mbit S and upload speeds up to 1 Mbit S. Kronogorsky Telecom deliver its services across the country. The Netherlands, as of October 2005, several wholesale DSL providers of ADSL2 Plus coverage on more than 50% of fixed phone lines in the Netherlands. As of September 2007 coverage is optional for 75% of all landlines, with about 1% of all connections having the option for Annex M. Norway, as of 2006, all major DSL providers in Norway offer ADSL2+, notable are DataGuard, Telenor, NextGenTel, Get, Mima, Inivest, Idesiva Bredby NND, NEAS and Ventilo. Poland, Orange Polska, Nisha and Multimo are offering ADSL2 Plus internet connection at speed up to 20 Mbit S slash 1 Mbit S. Portugal, Clix was the first operator providing ADSL2 Plus technology in 2005, later followed by Portugal Telecom Brands and Vodafone. These operators offer download speed up to 24 Mbit S with 1 Mbit S up. All three operators offer a triple play solution with TV over IP. In 2009 Portugal Telecom accelerated fiber optic install on the main cities of the country providing download speeds up to 100 Mbit S. Romania, the biggest ADSL provider, Romp Telecom is deploying ADSL2+, G992.5 and XA, mainly in medium and larger cities. Their current broadband offer tops up 20 Mbit S download 1024 KBITS upload. The new ADSL2 Plus infrastructure is available since Q2 2008. Russia, the Moscow ADSL provider MTS offers ADSL2 Plus for some phone lines in Moscow up to 20 Mbit S downstream 896 KBITS upstream. The global ADSL provider Rostelecom offers ADSL2 Plus for some phone lines in Moscow and Moscow region up to 15 Mbit S downstream. Serbia. Telecom SRBIJA offers ADSL2 Plus up to 20 Mbit S downstream and 1 Mbit S upstream. Moved to VDSL2 from February 1, 2013. Slovakia, most minor and major Slovak operators, now operates up to 20 Mbit S. The base speed is set at 5 Mbit S with upload speed up to 512 KBITS. The price starts at a 11.99 for flat. Deutsche Telekom AG with state control all end user telephone lines. Telecom in 2012 upgraded capacity of DSL AMs and is preparing for VDSL2 technology. July 31, 2013 was announced by Telecom to offer VDSL from September 1st with speed up to 50 slash 5 Mbit S. Also it will be offered by alternative ISPs. Spain, Jazztel the first operator to provide the ADSL2 Plus technology. Orange Teal 2 is bar plus or minus a telephone cubed Nico YA.com. Turkey, ADSL2 Plus download speed up to 24 Mbit S and upload 2 Mbit S for unlimited connection. ADSL2 Plus download speed up to 24 Mbit S and upload 1 Mbit S for unlimited connection. ADSL2 Plus download speed up to 24 Mbit S and upload 3 Mbit S for unlimited connection. 
ADSL 2 Plus download speed up to 24 Mbit S and upload 3 Mbit S for unlimited connection. ADSL 2 Plus download speed up to 24 Mbit S and upload 1 Mbit S for unlimited connection. ADSL 2 Plus download speed up to 16 Mbit S and upload 1 Mbit S for unlimited connection. ADSL 2 Plus download speed up to 16 Mbit S and upload 1 Mbit S for unlimited connection. ADSL 2 Plus download speed up to 24 Mbit S and upload 3 Mbit S for unlimited connection. ADSL 2 Plus download speed up to 24 Mbit S and upload 3 Mbit S for unlimited connection. ADSL 2 Plus download speed up to 16 Mbit S and upload 1 Mbit S for unlimited connection. ADSL 2 Plus download speed up to 24 Mbit S and upload 3 Mbit S for unlimited connection. Note. Not all of commercial providers listed. Ukraine. ADSL 2 Plus download speed up to 24 Mbit S and upload 3 Mbit S for unlimited connection. Prices for unlimited access are from 6 US dollars to 13 US dollars as of October 15, 2014, and varying from cheapest tariffs in major cities to more expensive in rural areas. ADSL 2 Plus download speed up to 24 Mbit S and upload 3 Mbit S for unlimited connection. Prices for unlimited access is fixed throughout companies' coverage in the country and equal to six US dollars as of October 15, 2014. United Kingdom, in the UK, various companies are deploying ADSL 2 Plus, with O2 and Tuscorly having the most extensive coverage as of February 2009. The majority of ADSL 2 Plus providers use a process of local loop and bundling by connecting a customer's phone line directly into their network, bypassing BT's core network, to provide ADSL 2 Plus lines. The availability is then limited only by the number of exchanges unbundled by each telecom operator, it is not necessary to wait for BT Group. BT Group, which owns nearly all the POTS infrastructure across the country began rolling out ADSL 2 Plus based services in January 2008 as part of his 21CN program to upgrade its core network. BT and are on track to enable exchanges serving around 90% of UK premises during spring 2013. Such operators include, Aquis which were early adopters of the BT Group Network Solutions, starting ADSL 2 Plus trials from October 2007 with national rollout following shortly afterwards. Andrews and Arnold supports ADSL 2 Plus on BT's 21CN exchanges, also running a trial based on B Unlimited's wholesale LLU service. ADSL 24 have launched their range of products based on the BT Group network. Bulldog Broadband 5 provided an ADSL 2 Plus service using the cable and wireless network, however since Tuscorny's takeover, no new customers can sign up for this service. Cable and Wireless Guernsey Shore Shore in Guernsey started rolling out 20 Mbit S on their Shore Internet Pro service in January 2011. Up to 20 Mbit S download, 1024 KBITS upload, 21 contention ratio, Demon thus have implemented the Pro range of products which utilize ADSL 2 Plus for faster download and upload speeds. Reasignet, now owned and sold by Sky, 6 is one of the larger ADSL 2 Plus providers in the country with 1,154 exchanges unbundled as of February 2009. UK Online also uses Zynet's backbone. And Europacom.net provides fast business quality 21CN broadband specifically for the retail, hospitality and payment card sectors. Cerberus Networks are providers of business ADSL 2 Plus services in the UK and have relationships with several major LLU providers. Services have up to 48 Mbit S downstream line rates and 5 Mbit S upstream when using the X2 bonded service. Eclipse Internet, 7, uses ADSL 2 Plus for all home and business customers. Supports the full 24 Mbit S downstream. Eclipse use the BT21CN network and Tiscola's LLU network. Gravity Internet are a business ISP who offer ADSL 2 Plus services up to 24 Mbit S based on BT21CN network. Karua Euro ISP of Kingston Communications supply ADSL 2 Plus up to 24 Mbit S since 2008 a Euro in the Hull area, 
McCase.net offer up to 24 bit S broadband via BT's 21CN network specifically tailored to support customers who require Mac OS X technical support. New Net 8 Supply 24 bit S and 14 bit S ADSL2 Plus with unlimited data transfer services on 10 South Coast exchanges since August 2007. Orange customers have reported the unadvertised introduction of ADSL2 Plus on LLU lines in some areas during April 2008, although speeds are now capped at some max levels. Origin Broadband The independent ISP and network operator provide truly unlimited ADSL2 Plus services nationwide. Timico, 9, offers business broadband services. Timico now offers a standard ADSL connection to the 21st century network in areas where it is available. This delivers download speeds of up to 20 Mbit S and up to 1.3 Mbit S upload speeds. TalkTalk Talk operates ADSL2 Plus services from their LLU enabled exchanges. Bluesnet, 10, a BTPLC subsidiary. Rolled out a full ADSL2 Plus service on October 21, 2009. You know broadband provide ADSL2 plus 24 bit S services via multiple LLU providers with capped and unmetered data transfer. UK Free Software Network were part of the initial trial of the BTWBC platform for ADSL2 plus services and began offering ADSL2 plus to customers commercially from the date it was first available. UKFSN also offers ADSL2 plus LLU services where available. ADSL bonding is offered via the BT platform. Utility warehouses a switchless carrier or reseller, largely based on the TalkTalk Talk infrastructure, who offers LLU and non-LLU up to 24 bit S. As with all ISPs, the actual throughput speed obtained in practice is usually somewhat lower. However, they offer, only on their standard packages a 28-day agreement rather than the usual 12-month or 18-month contract. They also offer fiber up to 76 Mbit S in various UK locations with an 18 month minimum term. Zen Internet Limited provide an ADSL2 Plus service on their Rochdale LLU exchange, three other local exchanges, and via 21CN across the UK as of October 19, 2009. Virgin Media, 11, now supports ADSL2 Plus. However, this is to be seen as supplementary to their own hybrid fiber coaxial cable network, which utilizes DOCSIS in preference to DSL. Virgin Media came about as a result of mergers between Toluist and NTL and a subsequent takeover of the Virgin Mobile business. The Phone Coop is a cooperative that now offers LLU. Users become members of the cooperative and thus can receive dividend on the operating surplus. Equals North America equals. United States, AT&T operates ADSL2 Plus across several markets, offering speeds up to 18 bit S down and 1 bit S up on a single line. Cavalier Telephone is a competitive local exchange carrier operating in the Midwest, Mid-Atlantic, and Southeast markets. CenturyLink as EMBARQ deployed its first ADSL2 Plus market on September 17, 2007 and has since upgraded their entire network to the ADSL2 Plus specification, providing up to 10 bit S downstream and 896 KBITS upstream service depending on a subscriber's distance from the central office. CenturyTel, the other half of what is now CenturyLink, has deployed ADSL2 Plus up to 10 bit S down and 768 KBITS up DSL and up to 4 streams of standard definition IPTV or 2 streams of standard definition and 2 streams of high definition in some of their service areas. Cornerstone Telephone is one of the largest competitive local exchange carriers in New York and is deployed and operates a broadband network supporting ADSL2 Plus and XL and M. Cornerstone supports on net customers in eastern New York. Datavo is a competitive local exchange carrier based in California and serving over 60 CALIX based central offices throughout Los Angeles County and Orange County. They offer ADSL2, T1s, and DSL service. Empire One Telecom, a competitive local exchange carrier in New York, has deployed ADSL2 and ADSL2 Plus bonded service with speeds up to 48 bit S down with 4 bit S up. 
Fairpoint Communications, has deployed ADSL-2 Plus to much of its areas, including Maine, New Hampshire, and Vermont, and other areas around the U.S. Fast Metrics, San Francisco-based business ISP which delivers ADSL-2 Plus to the San Francisco Bay Area at speeds to 15 bit S down and 1 bit S up. Business ADSL-2 Plus includes unlimited data, install, 1x IP address and hardware. Bonded ADSL-2 Plus available with speeds to 13 bit S down and 5 bit S up. Fast Metrics also offers businesses Metro Ethernet T1, DS3 and fiber internet services in the Bay Area. G4 Communications, the largest competitive local exchange carrier in New Hampshire, has deployed ADSL2 Plus service throughout the state of New Hampshire at speeds up to 24 bit S down with 1 bit S up. Global Capacity, has deployed services nationally in the United States and now operates in over 4200 central offices and manages the largest ADSL2 Plus network in the country. GVTC, Texas's largest telephone cooperative, uses ADSL2 Plus to provide 12-bit S Internet service over copper in areas that the co-op hasn't upgraded to fiber yet. GWI has deployed the service in areas of Maine and New Hampshire. LaunchNet has deployed ADSL2 Plus service in 11 markets throughout the U.S. with download speeds of 15-bit S and upload speeds of 1-bit S. North State Communications a regional incumbent local exchange carrier that serves the Piedmont area of North Carolina, offers ADSL2 Plus service at speeds up to 20 bit S down and 1 bit S up. Pioneer Broadband has deployed ADSL2 Plus service in northern Maine, offering speeds up to 48 bit S down and 2 bit S up with line bonding. Sonic.net an ISP based in Santa Rosa, California has deployed ADSL2 Plus services throughout the San Francisco Bay Area with speeds of up to 14 bit S down and 2 bit S up. ADSL2 Plus is marketed as Fusion, a service that includes unlimited data and unlimited POTS voice service. Visionary Communications, a Wyoming based ISP, has deployed ADSL2 Plus services within various Wyoming cities, including Casper, Gillette, Sheridan, Douglas, and Buffalo. Offering downstream speeds up to 15 bit S. Visionary also provides GSH DSL, Metro Ethernet, as well as T1, DS3, and fiber services in Wyoming. Windstream uses ADSL2 Plus to provide 12 bit S downstream, 768 KBITS upstream service to some of their residential customers, as well as 24 bit S downstream. 2 bit S up service to business customers. Independent telephone companies and rural carriers of North America probably have the highest total number of ADSL2 Plus subscribers collectively as they are using such technology to deliver the so called triple play voice, video, and data services in order to compete with the RBOCs and cable companies with their incumbent local exchange carrier and competitive local exchange carrier footprint. Canada Vodalink now also started to provide ADSL2 Plus service in Quebec and Ontario mostly using FTTN that is still just as fast and reliable. BCE Incorporated, A Eurobell service, marketed as fibers available in parts of Ontario and Quebec, though not all five packages are ADSL2 Plus. FTTN is often used by Bell for these services which is still reliant on copper wiring to customer premises. Bell Alien to Euro, 12, service is available in selected areas of Nova Scotia, New Brunswick, Newfoundland and Labrador and Prince Edward Island, subject to market requirements and technical feasibility. Colbinet has deployed the service in specific COs in Quebec. Fibernetics Corporation is one of Canada's fastest growing telecommunications companies. With competitive local exchange carrier status. They provide DSL and their unique IPPBX IP phone system to select areas of Ontario. Their ADSL2 Plus network covers parts of the Kitchener Waterloo region and Barrie. Cangunit, December 2008, started to offer ADSL2 Plus service at 8 bit S downstream with 800 KBITS upstream. The service is available only to the Bell network. 
ADSL 2 Plus Voice over IP DSL AM provided by CALIX C7, Open Face Internet a Euro, 13, service is available in parts of Quebec. Open Face specializes in Internet connections for businesses, with speeds of up to 22 Mbit S downstream and 22 Mbit S upstream. Sasktel in Saskatchewan. Sogtel is an independent phone company in Quake Copyright Beck that uses this technology to deliver triple play. TELUS in Alberta and British Columbia, Canada runs ADSL 2 Plus up to 25 Mbit S downstream, 6 Mbit S upstream. Tel Incorporated www.tel-inc.com in Ontario, runs ADSL 2 Plus up to 16 Mbit S down, 1.3 Mbit S up. Vianet Internet Solutions a Euro Vianet in Ontario. Supplies ADSL 2 Plus co-located DSL, up to 24 Mbit S downstream, up to 1.5 Mbit S upstream. Bit Communications services available in selected areas of Ontario, subject to the market requirements and technical feasibility. ADSL 2 is being deployed in selected areas to offer IPTV delivery, and higher access speeds. Mexico, Mexican operator Telmex runs ADSL 2 Plus service with a download speed of up to 24 Mbit S and upstream 1204 KBITS. This operator is deploying its FTTH network which is already available for certain customers. Equals Central America equals Guatemala, Telgua in Guatemala has deployed services across Guatemala City in nearby zones. It's deploying ADSL 2 Plus in other cities and now operates the largest ADSL 2 Plus network in the country. Deliver speeds capacity up to 5 Mbit S downstream and 1024 KBITS upstream and increasing. Costa Rica, in Stichuto Costa Ricense de Electricidad gives the services of ADSL 2 Plus to most of the country with speeds from 512 256 KBITS to 20 Mbit S down and 1 Mbit S up. Dominican Republic, Claro offers speeds ranging from 1 bit S down and 256 KBITS up to 10 bit S down and 1 bit S up. The upgrade to ADSL 2 Plus was required to provide enough bandwidth for the company's IPTV and voice over IP services. Puerto Rico, Claro offers speeds ranging from 512 KBITS down and 512 KBITS up to 15 bit S down and 1 bit S up equals South America equals Argentina ADSL 2 plus downstream speed up to 20 Mbit S and upstream 1 Mbit S a Euro www.telecom.com.ar and www.onit.com.ar Brazil ADSL 2 plus downstream speed up to 20 Mbit S and upstream 1 Mbit S ADSL 2 plus downstream speed up to 10 Mbit S and upstream 1 Mbit S ADSL 2 Plus downstream speed up to 20 Mbit S and upstream 1 Mbit S a Euro HTTP, www.circumtel.com.br. ADSL 2 Plus ADSL 2 Plus still running up to 10 Mbit S for download and 600 KBITS for upload. ADSL 2 Plus. HTTP, www.oi.com.br. Downstream speed up to 15 bit S and upstream up to 1 bit S, ADSL 2 plus downstream speed up to 12 bit S and upstream up to 1 bit S or 800 KBITS a euro although most of coverage area are limited to 8 bit S downstream 300 KBITS upstream due to distance from the CO, but mainly because of marketing practices, ADSL 2 plus ADSL 2 plus still running up to 15 bit S for download and 1 bit S for upload. Chile, Telefonica del Sur offers up to 20 Mbit S, video on demand, digital television and other products using ADSL 2 Plus. GTD Mancunu offers up to 20 Mbit S and other products using ADSL 2 Plus. Colombia, UNEEPM Telecommunications offers up to 10 Mbit S, IPTV using ADSL Plus 2. Redatezar ESP offers up to 4 Mbit S. IPTV using ADSL Plus 2 in Car Cubed are DOBA, Anchiquia, Suca, City of Valladupa and Municipality of Barranquilla. Venezuela, Nichino, 
CAN TV offers up to 10 bit S downstream and up to 512 or 768 KBITS upstream. It is well known that in Venezuela, Internet has slowdown problems on the downstream side, because CAN TV's links are saturated, due to high demand and low investments. Raised On April 8, 2013, CAN TV offered 4 bit service. On June 26, 2013, CAN TV offered 6 bit service. On May 22, 2014, CAN TV offered 8 bits and 10 bit service. Equals Oceania equals Australia. As of late 2008, all of Australia's largest ISPs are offering ADSL2 Plus services delivered on a variety of networks. The following list shows telecommunications providers who own and operate their own ADSL2 Plus infrastructure. Ornet, Adam Internet, Amnet, Aussie Broadband Proprietary Limited, EFT, Enet, Internode, Linear G Internet, Netspace, Nextep, Ongnet, Optus, Powertel, Preferred Internet Provider, Primus Telecom, TPG Telecom, Telstra, TSN Communications. Australia's first commercial ADSL2 Plus service was launched in 2005 by ISP Internode on the Agile DSL AM network. In 2006, Optus announced that it would sell its ADSL2 Plus network wholesale to other ISPs. At the completion of the rollout, the Optus DSL AM network was the largest wholesale ADSL2 Plus network in Australia, covering over 360 telephone exchanges. 2006 also saw Internode trial a Euro, and subsequently release a Euro ADSL2 Plus Annex M services for business users. In November, Telstra Big Pond, Australia's largest Internet service provider launched a retail ADSL2 Plus service to its customers. Although Telstra had been aggressively rolling out ADSL2 Plus DSL AMs for some time, the company made a strategic decision to enable services only where competitors had already deployed DSL AM infrastructure, citing the possibility of a forced wholesale regime by the Australian Competition and Consumer Commission. In 2007, Opal Networks was awarded nearly $1 billion of government funding to assist with a rollout of broadband in regional areas. Along with wireless broadband and an extensive fiber optic transmission network, the project was to see an extended rollout of ADSL2 plus DSL AMs to many regional centers. The program was cancelled in April 2008 by the Labor government, citing coverage issues. In January 2008 Telstra lifted the lid on its ADSL2 Plus network after the Australian Government and the Australian Competition and Consumer Commission issued guarantees that the company would not be forced to wholesale ADSL2 Plus services from its 900 ADSL2 Plus minus enabled exchanges. Seven months later, Telstra Wholesale signed agreements with People Telecom and PacNet to make ADSL2 Plus tails available to those customers. As of December 2008, out of 2759 ADSL enabled telephone exchanges, Telstra has enabled 1403 for ADSL2 Plus services. New Zealand Telecom New Zealand deployed its first ADSL2 Plus exchange in March 2007 and started upgrading exchanges with more than 500 lines. A program of deploying 3,600 roadside cabinets and 2,500 kilometers of new fiber optic cable to enable the delivery of broadband connections between 10 bit S and 20 bit S to 80% of New Zealanders by the end of 2011 was started. At September 2009, about 50% of the approximately 1.8M New Zealand homes were within reach of ADSL2. With the onset of local loop and bundling, Competing Internet service providers such as Compass, Cordless, Vodafone Ends and Orkin have also installed ADSL2 plus DSL AMs in telecoms exchanges. On March 13, 2008, Orkin announced that it was offering ADSL2 plus services to the general public. Following the structural separation of the incumbent Telecom New Zealand in November 2011, the wholesale arm chorus now own and operate Telecom's ADSL network. Chorus provide an ADSL2 broadband availability tool showing where their ADSL2 coverage is available. Or can have a coverage map showing where their ADSL2 coverage is available. 
equals African equals Egypt. TE Data has announced the launch of ADSL 2 Plus service with speeds up to 24 Mbps and they have used their wide coverage all over Egypt in order to avail this service in 99% of the land lines, building on its unique relationship with Telecom Egypt and being the largest ISP in Egypt regarding the international bandwidth available, which was clear when it was the only operating ISP during the famous Marine Cable Cup during February 2008. While Link.net had deployed ADSL 2 Plus on a normal copper line at 5 Mbit-S, 8 Mbit-S, 12 Mbit-S, and 24 Mbit-S being the first to offer beyond the 2 Mbit-S and also providing the highest in the country. Link.net claims that it has the fastest Internet access package in the Middle East. TE Data and Link.net are the only providers who provide ADSL 2 Plus in Egypt because of their use of Alcatel DSL AMs. Libya LTT company has begun providing this service in September 2007, it works fine, but the speed has not been increased yet, it is still 256 kbits download, and about 128 kbits upload for home users. It also provides XDSL services for business users with speeds from 256 kbits to 8 Mbps. In 2007 LTT company started to provide ADSL Plus 2 with 512 KBITS downstream for home users, also it launched in the beginning of 2009 the WiMAX called Libya Max which provides Internet Wireless. South Africa, Telcom SA has upgraded many of its exchanges to support ADSL 2 Plus up to a maximum downstream speed of 20 Mbit-S and 1 Mbit-S upload. As of August 2012 there are close to 200,000 subscribers upgraded onto this service. Availability is determined by the proliferation of higher bandwidth backhaul in order to support the larger amount of data required. Equals Asia equals Bahrain, three of Bahrain's ISPs, Betelco, Etizelcom and Lyspeed Communication provide up to 16 bit S downstream of ADSL 2 plus broadband internet connection with only Betelco supporting up to 2 bit S upstream. Bangladesh, BTCL Euro Bangladesh Telecommunications Company Limited provides up to 2 bits downstream with its ADSL 2 plus broadband internet connection. Although there are new internet service providers such as Kerbe and Banglalian who are also offering up to 2 MPS. Other than that several other network providers such as Gramanphone, Aktl, Airtel, Cetachel and Banglalink. China, Hong Kong's largest internet service provider and Vigator provides 18 bit S downstream of ADSL 2 plus broadband internet connection. India, Parat Sanchar Nigam Limited, BSNL offers ADSL 2 Plus broadband under the Data 1 brand name, with advertised speeds up to 24 Mbps, likewise, MTNL offers the tri-band service. Airtel claims a maximum speeds of up to 16 Mbps for its ADSL 2 Plus service. TTML and BSNL also provide ADSL 2 Plus, with speeds up to 2 Mbps. India has over 7 million DSL subscribers, 80% of which are on the ADSL 2 Plus standard. In India, ADSL 2 Plus will need to compete with the homegrown and government-supported HDVSL standard which supports 36 Mbps download speeds. Indonesia, Telkom a Euro PT. Telecomunikasi Indonesia provides up to 3 Mbps downstream with ADSL 2 Plus broadband internet connection called Speedy CBN Internet a Euro PT. Cyber Indo Aditama provides 10 bit S downstream and 1 bit S upstream of ADSL 2 Plus broadband internet connection called CBN Direct Net INAGE, mainly available in high rise residential. Iran In Iran, the maximum available downstream rate for limited data usage is 10 bit S and it costs about $10 for 8 GB maximum data usage per month and the maximum available downstream rate for unlimited data usage is 2 bit S and it costs about $23 per month. In Iran, access to many social networks, such as Facebook, Twitter, Google+, is restricted and illegal. Israel, Bezek, in November 2007, started to offer ADSL 2 Plus service at 8 Mbps download with 800 KBITS upload. The service is available only to 40% of the customers, 
living near the switch. At the beginning of 2009, BZX started to deploy the NGN service that delivers higher speeds of up to 15 MB using ADSL2 Plus and up to 100 Mbps using VDSL2, to all customers, by cutting the distance to the DSLAM. Kazakhstan, Megalin, a subsidiary of Kazakh Telecom is operated at a maximum speed of 8 Mbps for downstream and 1 Mbps for upstream. Q8 Quilly Tynet in Q8 provides up to 24 Mbps downstream and 1 Mbps upstream of unlimited ADSL2 plus broadband internet connection. Bonding service is also offered by this provider for the areas that doesn't handle high-speed broadband connection. KEMS is another ISP which offers unlimited ADSL2 plus that goes up to 20 Mbps downstream and 1 Mbps upstream. Fast Telco also offering similar services providing unlimited ADSL2 Plus with maximum speed of 24 Mbps downstream and 1 Mbps upstream respectively. Lebanon, Urgero has started to deploy ADSL2 Plus in Lebanon in June 2007. Today, more than 95% of the subscribers are covered. In July 2014, prices were brought down to become one of the most attractive in the Middle East region. Starting at 24,000 LL slash month for 2 Mbps downstream 512 Kbps upstream 40 GB cap. Higher speeds are also available at very affordable and competitive prices, reaching 6 a Euro 8 Mbps for less than $75 with 100 GB cap. Malaysia, ADSL2 Plus is provided by Malaysia's largest internet service provider Telecom Malaysia under the brand of Streamix. Oman, Omantel Company provides ADSL2 Plus in Oman. Starting on April 27, 2008 to be the first telecommunication company that provides ADSL Plus in the Persian Gulf region. Pakistan, PTCL, under the brand name of Broadband Pakistan, is Pakistan's largest ADSL2 Plus service provider. It provides data service of up to 10 bit S for home users, and at up to 15 bit S for corporate offices. The prices per bit S is one of the lowest in the world at PKR. 525. The unlimited package of 1 bit S costs only PKR. 1299 month. Habib Graphic International provides DSL data connectivity across Pakistan since January 2003, with major POPs in Lahore, Islamabad, Rawalpindi, Peshawar. Karachi and Silkut. Micronet provides DSL services in Pakistan since July 2002. Islamabad and Rawalpindi are the major cities covered by MBL. Link.net, a project by Arasom, started its services in Pakistan at the end of 2007, now defunct. Philippines, Globe Telecom, under to 2 Home Broadband DSL and Talk Broadband. Up to 15 bit s downstream and up to 1.2 bit s upstream. PLDT, under PLDT Home My DSL, up to 10 bit s downstream, up to 900 kbits upstream. Eastern Communications, under EVO DSL, up to 8 bit s downstream. Saudi Arabia, STC offers ADSL2 Plus service at maximum of 20 bit s downstream data rate. The service is called XBAND Judend as of 2013 costs 249 Saudi reals per month. The maximum attainable data rate however depends on the location and is usually less than stated maximum of 20 Mbps at most locations. Singapore, Singapore's largest ADSL internet service provider Singnet under the subsidiary of Singtel provides 25 Mbps downstream and 1 Mbps upstream of ADSL2 plus broadband internet connection. Sri Lanka, Sri Lanka's fixed network ISP Sri Lanka Telecom provides 16 Mbps downstream and 1 Mbps upstream of ADSL2 plus broadband internet connection as of 2012. Thailand High-speed Internet ISPs deploy ADSL2 Plus services over POTS. There is also an XM support in some areas. 3BB by Triple T, providing 20 Mbit S downstream with 1 Mbit S upstream. TOT Hispid by TOT, providing 20 Mbit S downstream with 1 Mbit S upstream. True Online by True Corporation, providing 16 Mbit S downstream with 1 Mbit S upstream. 
high knit by cat, providing 16 bit s downstream with 1 bit s upstream. United Arab Emirates, the Tisalit offers ADSL 2 plus in speeds of 2 bit s all over the UAE, and up to 4 bit s in some areas that support it. The Tisalit have chosen not to improve their ADSL speeds any further, as they have already started implementing high speed cable connections using fiber optics which supports speeds up to 500 Mbps. See also, ADSL, HDVSL, List of Device Bandwidths, VDSL2. References External links, ITUT Recommendation G992.5 Asymmetric Digital Subscriber Line Transceivers A Euro Extended Bandwidth ADSL2, HTTP, Home Health Upcom ADSL.